the 13th of March 2023, Alimosha youths gathered together. <laughs> At the Sherry Roundabout, just a few places from Megbeda bus stop to receive Sheyi Tinobu, son of the President elect of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. <laughs> The gathering of youths from various groups, championed by Bola Metinobu Youth Orientation Network Pachin under the leadership of Honorable Sini Olajde Ahmed and ASM, Ashiwaju Solidarity Movement, a group supported and founded by the apex leader of the APC in Alimosho, Honorable Princess. These two groups and various pocket groups of young people came together in solidarity for Ashiwajibola Metinubu and particularly to campaign for Governor Babajide Sawulu's second term bid. <laughs> Sheyi Tinubu's team first visited the palace of the Unigondo of Igondo where about 15 different Abbas, first class, second class, and traditional chiefs from across Alimosho and Environ had gathered. The chiefs received them with joy and shared their opinion about the current political instability in the state with them. They advised the youth on how to proceed for the coming election. Lati, 
And in response, Shehi Tinubu also thanked them for the support given to his father when he was contesting for the position of president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and how he emerged. However, charged both the young and the old on how to make sure Governor Babajide Somwalu emerges as governor of Lagos State for second term, citing his performance as one of the best that can be seen across the country. I heard my brother speaking here. Tonso of Ibo, Tonso of Voting. My daddy, generations is why not so. It's time for no Latin. It's time for no Latin for what I've heard my two brothers speaking very and for last year on my ship. It's your kingdom. Could I say anybody told me a bull over in the kingdom? Could I say a monty or a boy she told me she could do any question? But at the same time, no, it's time for that to continue our own house. And they spoke very loud during the last election. And that's the truth. But at the same time, our own proposal did not come out to vote because there was that perception of Emma Warrior or Tim Warrior. And that's what I was talking to my other daddy here. There is time for all of us collectively to put our individual efforts in and all come out for the greater purpose of Lagos. Lagos is in that way. Like you also said as well, because the governor of Abolim Bouton, she shared you, governor, Chile, Barrios, and so on. There's nobody. There's no governor that's done more work than him. There's no governor that's been all inclusive. There's no governor that's been youth oriented. There's no governor that's actually executed more projects. But unfortunately, pocket communities have also not been heard. And the both stops at the table, at the top, but we all have to take responsibilities for what we have done right. The Director General of Bola Metinubu Youth Orientation Network, Bachion Honorable Senior Lajdi Ahmed, also had this to say. I'm not going to do it because area specialization is a camera. We need to get back into the land. If you are a beautiful, fresh graduate, to pay years of experience here, you cannot put a project here to get now. Come with that to me now. No, you don't know why. You know we can't do it. We are always proud of our happy, our but I am not proud of our people. But it has to be a of experience so that we get a call and we pull up. Say, if our youth, we must have a youth of hope. We only go to the only artist who are doing hands up. He was about to be so pretty. He came. He joined on our hands up. He made the protest to talk. What you got to play with? We will not see your door. President Muhammad Buhari, who is not much shaken by Nigeria. So come and tell them. He deserves a second. Time. By the time Sheyi Tinobu arrived to the venue, he shared a roundabout where the youth had gathered. He mixed with them, sharing his opinion and showing that he is truly a son of the soil and one who does not segregate or discriminate. <laughs>
Welcome back to the bumper breakfast. Yes, sir. The campaign, campaign, I wish the campaign. people can see you behind the camera. How can you just... What kind of switch was that? What kind of switch was that? Yeah. I've got some power behind the camera. Then they will not own the camera. Welcome to our, our TV presenter. You can't pay me. You, you, know you, <laughs> <laughs> you know, we do what we have to do. Uh, All right, we have been talking politics and it's time to talk about arts and culture. How much do we appreciate our culture and our arts, this part of the world? We have uh, the best, the foremost female drummer in the studio with us this morning. And we're just talking about Anwar. We'll be back after this very quick break. <laughs> 